end, but for the most part, you know, efforts there. We're just, we got to just get that much better Wednesday, that much better Friday, so that we'll be rolling here pretty soon. Talk about your first day uh, practice at BYU. What's it, what was it like coming back here and being uh, being a, being a coach? Yeah, it was uh, awesome. Probably like an eight-year-old kid at Christmas. So it was very exciting. Your great energy. You love being around Coach Mendenhall and the way he's doing things. And obviously, Coach and I coaching me way back when, I think in the dark ages. But yeah, it was like a little kid at Christmas. Talk about today's accomplishments. What you guys want to come out as accomplish today as a coaching staff? I think the most important thing, uh, especially up front, is our tempo. Just understanding how fast the game can go, uh, how fast we need to go. Uh, that was that was definitely uh, one of the key components of today. <laughs> with the overall performance today? Uh, we, need, we need to get better. We need to get better. Our, our energy level needs to stay as strong as it was in the beginning all the way through practice. So that, that'll be a major emphasis for us on Wednesday. Coach Mendenhall seemed to be working a lot on the offensive side of the ball with you guys. Uh, what's it like working with him? And was it just more just to make sure that the offensive guys are just all in a cohesive manner? I, yeah, I think so. And I, you know, I think obviously be, there's some newity to it and him making sure that we're, we're presenting exactly what he wants and then also to just seeing it for himself. Um, but I, I mean, anytime the head coach comes over, as a player or as a position coach, I mean, obviously you take pride in that. Absolutely. Desire and the want to be great is definitely there. It's getting that that ability to be at that same level. Um, you know, the guys that are there are doing a great job, and, and I believe that their their emphasis and their energy is as great as it's given us everything they can. It's just not quite where it needs to be yet. Obviously, six new offensive linemen coming in, in the fall. Are, are these guys aware of it? Do you make them aware of it? That Every day. Every day, every day, there's guys that aren't here doing secret little training sessions on their own, coming in to, to, to you know be a part of a team, but obviously take jobs. What are your hopes for the offensive line this year as compared to last season? Uh, you know, not knowing much about last season, not being here, I, I'll tell you directly. My my emphasis is to have a dominating offensive line, to exert our will, to steal that will from other men. Uh, that will be our main focus. Are you kind of in an evaluating process right now? Just kind of evaluating Absolutely. the individual guys? Absolutely. And just I mean, everything's being viewed through a clear lens, a clean lens. All the guys know that. They know that the opportunities are going to be just as good for the guy standing next to them.